Hello friends. First of all, thank you for clicking our video. In this video, we are going to share our understanding on planning the project. Let's get started. What is a project? A project is a contemporary business and a science treat as project any undertaking. Carry out individually or collaboratively and possibly involving research or design. That's, that is carefully planned by project team to achieve a particular aim. So what are the three main project targets? The first one is performance, second is cost, and the third one is time. So what are the characteristics of project? The first one is unique, second is specific deliverable, and the third one is specific due date. What is a project management? A project management is an application of knowledge, skills, tools, techniques to project activities in order to meet a stakeholder needs and expectation from a project. So why do companies use a project management? First, handle project effectively. Second, plan and assess resources need for the project. Third one is to estimate project cost. Fourth one is to plan and schedule activities. And the fifth one is to access risk and failure and make backup plans. And the last one is lead project team effectively. So, to become a good project manager, you need to have four criteria. He must be able to facilitate. So what is facilitate? He must be able to manage and supervise the project. And also he must be able to be good in micromanagement. Next, he must be a communicator. He must be the middleman between the senior management, the project team, other parties and the client so that they can resolve the issues between them. Next, a project manager needs to have three responsibilities in him. Must have adequate resources, a fighting spirit, a leadership, and he must able to make trade-off. Next, he needs to have a good skill, negotiation skill, conflict resolution, and a persuasion skill. To plan a project, the project manager should prepare an overview and the objective. To get start, you should answer these seven questions. What, why, who, how, when, where, and how much. For first question, what is your idea? Describe what you want to do and what would you call this project. And the second question, why is this important to your community? and how will the community benefit from this project? For next question, who? Who will be involved in the project? And who will the project benefit? For fourth question, how is the project going to work? And the fifth question, when? When will the project happen? And when are the critical dates across the project? For sixth, where? Where is the project take place? And the last question, how much the budget will be take? Based on these 7 questions, the more answer you give, the more likely to succeed. Okay, now we are moving to the budgeting the project. Budgets are plans for allocating organization resource to project activities. There are two types of method of budgeting, which is top-down budgeting and bottom-up budgeting. For top-down budgeting, it was based on collective judgment and experience of top and middle manager. Overall project cost estimated by estimating cost of major tasks. For bottom-up budgeting, if we identify the elemental tasks and those responsible for executing, this task estimate resource requirement. In budget, it also includes the cost estimating, which we can say is properly mostly about the work, ele work element costing which is to determine resource requirement and then cost for each task to improve cost estimate we can use the learning curve method and tracking signal thank you for watching our video if you like our video please don't forget to click the like button below